everybody. It's Christine. Thank you so much for, hey, everybody. I think it's live now. Anyway, thanks for stopping in. I really appreciate it uh, for visiting me here at Texas, or Peace Dealer, Texas. Um, <clears throat> so this weekend started on Friday, obviously, um, where I went to thrift stores, garage sales, estate sales. And today was Sunday, and I did most of it this Sunday. And um, I had a good time. I had a lot of fun. I left my husband at home. He was uh, sleeping in. So I, I thought, you know what? I'm just going to let him sleep. And I'm going for um, just down. The, it's, it's on that side of town um, on thrifting because there's about nine different thrift stores in about a seven to 10 mile radius um, of where I live. So when I've started, I try to go to all of them, at least, you know, I just kind of trickle them out. And I am also focusing on not uh, getting too much back stock, you know, just sitting death pile or whatever you want to call it, money pile. Um, I'm almost, I've got a rolling rod right here with probably about, I don't know, 40 clothing items that are going are in the process of being steamed tomorrow, photographed this week too. So um, I will go ahead and start with the, uh, with the thrift store that's in my neighborhood. I'm going to move my keyboard because I don't want to hit anything. Hang on. <laughs> the security of forehead. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> the forehead of security. The forehead that I was super, super excited about. It is... You know, where this is from but it is absolutely adorable and i originally saw the top it's got this little i don't know what it is it's a hedgehog is it i think it might be a hedgehog or and a little rabbit and a raccoon and um anteater maybe <laughs> but he's got little robes on it and it is as soft as butter the other thing i liked about it is it had the um uh, sweatshirt things. So, and I thought, you know, wow. I said, well, it doesn't have the bottom, so I'm just going to leave it behind. Well, what I realized was that when I was going through the uh, workout clothes, the active wear, I found the pants. So we went back directly, very extra large. Yeah, both of them were extra large tall, which is great. And I was like, man. So I was going to put, I put back the pants. And when I was checking out behind the camera, it's kind of like they have a rolling rod of putbacks. And I said, can I get that? <laughs> and he was like, yeah. I was like, I'll find it. And I couldn't find it anymore. So I was kind of bummed, but I got it. Yay. Okay. So the other thing is, is, um, kind of um, little cha-cha. Um, I hope this video works because it's kind of getting not pixelated, but it kind of skips. But it's got some satin, um, uh, what is it called? Silky satin. This is the pants and the top. And it's absolutely adorable. Uh, but it is definitely for younger gals, uh, maybe, you know, a honeymoon it's got this little tank and it's adorable. It's got the little tie at the front and then it's got the pants. You know, definitely a nice little, you know, sexy lounge wear. And then I've got some real lightweight PJ salvage um, with the little pink drawstrings, lightweight broadcloth um, pajamas. Those are great. Um, the Fredericks is only going to be about maybe 15 and the PJ and it should do well. So this here is um, called Diplomat, and it is a large and vintage, and I, I believe it's vintage. I don't know. Maybe it's not. It's made in the USA, um, but it's it's that old grandpa, uh, grandpa pajamas. Can you see? And then it has the... Um, the pants along with it. So that's going to be a real, I, you know what, every time I put those up in my, in my store, I sell them within a couple of days. So that's always cool. And then I got some workout pants and <laughs> those are for me. <laughs> I got to wash them. That's it's a no brainer. I mean, that's a good 15 bucks it's for, to do a picture, click, 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 list, list, list. And it's, it's a pretty good deal. And then this here, um, nightgowns, robes that are in good condition plus sizes are always look at the color on that is that not gorgeous this is just a long no you know honestly big girls like to be pretty too so we got to be you know aware of that 
So I got that for me. And then here is um, some workout clothes. I've never really sold a whole lot of workout clothes, but I did get, um, I got this, a pair of leggings, and they are um, a brand, I think it's um, Marika. Can you see that? Marika? I think it's called. And it's an extra large. It's got the little pockets and everything like that. So that's really cool. And, you know, I don't really know what it's going to. I should have looked it up. But I actually like the color. And I liked the uh, the um, the texture of them. And then a sports bra for big girls. Um, there's that. Did you even get a little sick? It's like a little racer back on it. And it's uh, got a rib cage. Um, so look at that mini skirt got rock and this one here is picasso no Perugo? i don't know if you guys you guys are welcome to uh welcome to show me the um how to in the comments how to pronounce when i posted my last video last week i <laughs> i mean it's okay i get it uh, but i really didn't like it and um but they did have one thing or two things a belt buckle that i cannot find um it's in somewhere uh but it's a it's a round leather belt buckle and it's got a rose tooled in it it's a yellow opened up for me it's kind of cool I, I think it's kind of cool so that probably maybe 25. Um, we'll see. We'll definitely see. So then we went to, um, I'm going to scoot over here and get the other one. Cause I'm, and I did that on Friday and I, I kind of liked it. And that was my husband. <laughs> Hi, Kenneth. <laughs> it's kind of got a wide screen. I didn't think uh, he's been hanging out doing his, <laughs> And that's my little Esther coming in. <laughs> um, hi, Esther. What are you doing? Hi, baby. Okay. Let's move this and let's move this up here. Bag by Mardell. I looked it up and it is one of the styles that they do have. And it is definitely leather. Very well made. There is a little bit of a discouraging thing that I found when I got home. And I was like, oh, man. The leather came apart, so I don't know exactly what I'm going to do. Maybe I can take it to the cobbler, but I don't know. Maybe one of these days I'll tell you about my cobbler story. Anyways, I have never have been able to find decent handbags over at Goodwill. Um, but there is a lot of women who like vintage hand-tooled um, handbags. Look at that. Is that not gorgeous? Now, over at the uh, flea market over in Fort Worth, they do have some, but the dude wanted 100 bucks for a brand new one and definitely not as cool. But, I mean, it's actually in pretty good condition. Um, I'm really I'm really impressed with it. Now, I got at the Goodwill um, is this Paisley uh, Kiss. What is that called? A Kiss? A Kiss Lock? A kiss lock, and like I said, it's, it's actually really clean. That's a you know fifteen. It's not it's not going to make me rich, but you know what? It's it's income, and I'm super excited about that. So then, you know, I don't know if you guys are aware, but um, if you're if you're a reseller, silk pajamas sell. If you can find 100% silk in good condition. Um, with desirable brands, you will be able to sell them. Um, so this here is a Victoria's Secret. It has covered buttons and it's a night shirt. So it's not like, it's not too sexy, but it is everyday romance. <laughs> but that's, that's it. And it is gorgeous. And that will definitely sell for about 20. Um, and then I got another Victoria's Secret uh, night shirt. And this is a jacquard fabric. I don't know if you can see that or not. But it is just absolutely gorgeous. And another night shirt is wonderful. So this here, I know you guys know what these are, the, um, the willow, willow tree the angels. What I like to do with these is I like to put them in my plants. I'll put them in like the, where the, right on the dirt in my plants on my front porch. I uh, haven't put them any in my backyard yet. 
um, just because my backyard, my patio has been a terrible mess because my husband's been redoing the garage. But she was only $1.99, which I thought was fabulous because usually when you find them on um, Marketplace or something like that, people want $10. I know. I hear you, sweetheart. My little baby girl, she's wanting attention. Okay. So this here, I don't know if it'll sell or not, but I figured since the holidays are coming, this is completely beaded. It's all beaded. Look at that. It is absolutely amazing. No stains, nothing. Um, it's a table runner. And I think for the holidays, it's good. It was $250. 249 so I could not just leave that behind so that definitely was going to be purchased by me this here is a vintage um and this is another little bolo for you guys this is a vintage bed jacket look how adorable that is it's a vintage bed jacket um I just posted another pink one. I, I put it's in my store, um, Peace Dealer, Texas. If you just look on Google, I show right up like that. Um, and I've got a pink one that's kind of a, a really light cotton. This one's polyester and it is so soft, but this one here is just gorgeous. Uh, but the bed jackets really sell. I've got one on the rolling rod that's ready for process and I'll be getting that listed this week. West. Eileen West um, is, does really well. I, I do really well with Eileen West. It usually has like fleece. I mean, it's amazing. And it's a pant. It's a little pant set and it's got pockets. And this is a an extra large, which is going to be fabulous. That's a good $30. Okay, hey, I found my belt buckle. Are you ready? Are you ready? It's not hand tooled. I take it back. It is embroidered. Look at that. Is that not gorgeous? Look at that. It barely even looks used, um, but it is, I think, gorgeous. I love it. And then I got this little lady. She's made in Mexico. It's just a little resin. Maybe it's a boy. Oh, she looks like a, I don't know. I, I liked it. I thought it was really pretty. It's just a, a little resin thing. Um, and then... This is, you know, it, it's fabulous. This is an easy 30 box right here. Um, brand new with the tags from Dillard's. Again, Eileen West. Um, Elaine West. Eileen West. <laughs> Eileen West. A little sleeveless doodity. Little night, night dress. Not one, but two. And both of these are sm size small. So I'm sure the same lady bought them and just left them in their closet uh, but that one's a really pretty blue print uh, but it's very feminine i think it's very feminine um to wear that kind of a pajamas now this one here i have sold this brand um i don't there it is and it was 50 percent off of eight so it was four dollars and it is 100 percent silk and it's a two-piece set. It's a two-piece pant set. Now, people like this. I mean, a lot of the people that are living in the uh, 50 and above communities, they have little house parties where they do, you know, little hors d'oeuvres, modern day Dick Van Dyke type thing. You know, they, they, they look very put together. So my connection came, but two people are watching. So, hey, <laughs> okay, so let's see. Do we want to go to the estate sale or do we want to wait to show you what I got from the garage sale? I want two garage sales and an estate sale. So I'm going to go ahead and go to the estate sale. But I do want to talk about Goodwill. I hadn't gone to Goodwill. I, I don't really go to Goodwill for a lot just because the prices are kind of high. Um, but, you know, sometimes they're okay. Well, I've got gray hair. You can see it right there. And the lady is, you know, she's seen me in there before. And she asked me, she it was, I guess it was seniors day and I'm 53. I mean, I'm not afraid to say how old I am. Um, and she asked me if I was a senior and I said, well, no, I said, unless your policy is 53 and under or over is for a you know, seniors discount. She goes, yeah, you, you qualify. And I said, Okay. So she gave me an additional 30% off. And I was like, yeah, <laughs> I was like, okay, you know, Hey, I told you the truth. So, 
I mean, that was kind of cool. Um, so I'm going to go through the one of the garage sales. I'm going to do the garage sales. So I um, I went to this one lady. She is going to be moving to Florida. And uh, I guess she retired. But her little story was so sweet. This coffee cup, you see that little mouse? Is that She had said was these were her very first coffee mugs she bought as an it felt on her lips so she bought two coffee mugs and took them to work and kept them in her desk and drank coffee from these at her first job ever in the early 70s and i was like you know what that is so sweet i love that so i got those right there um coffee mugs like that always usually sell for me so then she had these two other coffee mugs which i thought think are really nice and i'm at 19 minutes um, and this is, uh, they're not microwavable safe, but there's no chips on them. And I just think they're wonderful. I just, um, there is a following for these and she charged me a dollar each. I don't know how much I'll sell them for, but they're adorable. I mean, and they're huge too. I guess you could have some soup out of them. Um, I'm actually new to regular glasses. I had just been buying the, uh, the, uh, store-bought readers um but she had some <laughs> sears optical lens cleaners so i'll keep these in my car my you know I, I have those little those little cleaner things but i don't seem to be doing it okay so then i got this and this this is uh two chanel one's empty it's they still smell delicious i i own it like chanel and i do like it um, but this one here has the bottle and the box. And, you know, both of these will probably be a good $25. Believe it or not, empty bottles of cologne. You know, I love it. I, I think it's I think it's wonderful. Um, all right. That's what I got from her. Uh, she is going she was downsizing because she's moving to Florida. Um, she was super nice like, in my neighborhood. So um I knew her. So the last garage sale that I went to, and then we'll go on to the state sale, um, is one here also in my neighborhood. And it was kind of a, oh, look, there's a sale. <laughs> Move my car. Um, don't be afraid. I used to never, 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 never ask anybody if they'd be willing to take less. Um, and I watch YouTube videos and I kind of like get coaching on how to do it. So what I said was, would you be willing to take 15? Um, but I was getting, uh, I only had a certain amount of cash on me and, uh, I, I said, okay, cool. So I got this and then I got, what else did I get from her? Oh, two speakers. I got two uh, computer speakers and they are out cuttings and rooted them and put the, and made babies you know <laughs> she made more and i have a uh, a vintage wooden ice cream um maker and i had my husband drill a hole in it and then i will put that um rosemary in there so that it can grow in there and i think it's going to be fabulous all right but so i got the speakers the rose the rosemary uh, bush and then look at this oh my Goodness, this is a queen size, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful velvet cutout. Um, it's by Bates. It's a queen size, made in the USA. Made in the USA? I believe it did say made in the USA, but I don't know where the little tag is now. And I don't want to go through looking for it. But in any event, um, this one, the last sold one was $299. And the person paid shipping, I believe. So I'm super stoked about that. Um, I'm just, I, I dig it. I, I think it's just really groovy, but it's a little to be ooped out about buying bedspread for, you know, and then using it. I wouldn't, I, I, I have no problem with it. And it says that my connection is unstable again. So I hope that it, it works. Well, it went away. So, all right, on to the garage, to the estate sale. Now I have learned that I, like I said, I'd never reused to um, ask for discounts, but I have learned to ask. And at this particular estate sale, they were not haggling and it was very obvious they were not haggling. And I'm saying to myself, that's crazy. I said, well, what are you guys going to do? Because the house was full. 
Um, and it was our last day and they stopped that too. And I said, what are you guys going to do with all this extra stuff? Are you going to be having another sale next weekend? And she said, no, we're going to donate it all. And I said, what? And she said, yeah. And I said, but I keep hearing that you guys aren't wheeling and dealing and making bulk deal or you're like bundled prices. That's going to be so sad. And you know, it's kind of, if you think about it, when you go to estate sales, um, there are people who, um, when they go to estates, when they're having an estate sale and it's their family member and it's a family run estate sale, this is you know, their mom's stuff you're thrifling through, you know? So, I mean, I kind of get it, you know, Bionic, Bionic, I got to clean them up a little bit, but they came with the original box, got those for two fifty, and then another pair of Bionics, pair of brown ones, very nice, very uh, clean. I uh, got those also for two fifty, and those are a good twenty five thirty dollars, just depending. This one, check this out. Now I have absolutely no doubt that this woman and it's quilt. It's not quilted. It's just it's quilted. <laughs> I think that's pretty much what you call quilted. Um, but it looks three of these. You get three of these. The oil. Um, treatment. These I got for 50 cents each. It says a dollar there, but she, everything there at the estate sale was 50% off. So I looked them up and they go for $19 a piece. I was like, okay. So I, I bought three of them. This one has a little bit and this one has a little bit. So they're not full, but um, they still sell. I get a dollar. Um, I believe that this is a a valve because this turns maybe for I think it turns <laughs> I, I turned it earlier yeah it turns um, I think it might be like a gas valve for the indoors for those uh, radiators but it's gorgeous I, I, mean, I don't know I'll have my husband take a look at it but I thought for 50 cents I got a chamois for the car so that's that. And like I said, it's really dirty. Let me move them over here out of my way because they were in the garage. And uh... <laughs> all right. So some of the things that she had were so crazy priced. And like I said, they had so much and they were just so overpriced, even at the 50%. And I'm not surprised that they had so much stuff. And, you know, I get it. I, I understand it's hard to sell stuff that was your mother's. But this belt, I mean, kid, look at this belt. Look at this concho belt. It's a 1985 concho belt with little sunflowers on a leather belt. And it was, is that not gorgeous? Yeah, so I was absolutely astounded. And then two belts, uh, I'll be happy with those. I don't know exactly what I'll price them at. Maybe I'll lock them up. I don't know. Um, two Dallas Cowboy vintage t-shirt or sweatshirts. Um, they have a couple of little stains on them, but you know what I really like about them is you know how Champion uh, the reverse uh, weave, I believe that's what it's called, the reverse weave, um, is very, very nice. This here is that same stuff. It's not, these are not champion, but they really, they, they absorb the, if you hit, get sweaty, they absorb. So, okay, this is something that I bought from me and I was so excited about it. I bought a large bottle from my Avon lady of Skin So Soft and I was going to buy the bottle from her, but this was 50 cents over there. So now I have, I have the huge bottle. So when I'll, I'll use this, if it doesn't, if it's not gross, um, and I'll just keep refilling this. So I was kind of stoked. I know it's the little things in life that help. What else? Okay. A vintage Christmas tree thing. I don't believe that this has, is brand spanking new. I think they just kept the thing because it's in there upside down. So I think it's really cool for 50 cents. Um, and then I got uh, dun, 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 a quilting book. This thing, oh, I had it upside down, sorry guys, um, is amazing. It has got, I, I almost kind of think that I'm going to take a look at it and study it for a little while because quilts, um, are, are a good thing and they sell well. So I might just educate myself a little bit more on um, on quilts 
and um, we'll go from there. We'll, we'll see. And then after I'm done with it, I'll list it. So Norman Rockwell, this I bought really um, not because it was a dollar fifty, but I don't know if you guys know this or not, but in Washington, D.C. that last week, um, the, um, the Hall of Fame inducted um, the, in the Women's Hall of Fame the Rosie the Riveters. There were several women that they that they um, interviewed, and they were 99, 101, and they showed this particular picture of Rosie the Riveter. Look at that! And her little lunchbox says Rosie. And then here's something else. Foot on it. Ah, I love those. Anyway, so I got that, and then this right here. I've never, I'm getting out of my comfort zone, uh, you know, and a lot of times I don't really, uh, it's hard getting out of your comfort zone, but I did it anyway, because let me get this little price sticker off. It was $5 less 50%. So two fifty, and it is a Daewoo VCR. DVD combo. Yay, yay, yay. So for $250, I was willing to get out of my comfort zone and try something new because I usually don't sell electronics. Now, I did last week sell a, um, a Xbox 360 Slim and a Wii um, and some DV or some some games that went with it for, you know, some pretty good cash. <laughs> so and, and they were gifted to me. So... That was cool. So what else? I really appreciate you guys coming out and hanging out with me. I've got two people watching and I don't know who you guys are because I'm so new to YouTube and doing it live. So thank you very much for watching. I really like it. Um, I really, really like this. Um, let's see. I've got one other one, one other um, thrift store that I went to on Friday. This is a Starbucks Hawaii. Uh, cup and look at that it's got like little fish in there i think it's fabulous i love it um and then th that wasn't really anything oh this this is a pajama set it's satin silk not not silk satin um silky satin um so that basically means polyester but it still will sell and this is a uh valerie stevens it's a it's a medium and you know just uh you know ready too much. I will be back again. Um, and I don't know if I'll do live um, again. Maybe I will. I don't know. I mean, but I just, sometimes I feel like I just need to be thrown to the wolves. <laughs> you know, um, did I just call you guys wolves? <laughs> um, sometimes I just need to drive, dive in. Um, and that way I get used to things. So with that being said, I really appreciate you guys. Um, this is my background. This is all my inventory, but this used to be a, uh, a bedroom. So, and now it's my, my office. So in any event, I really appreciate you guys coming in. If you have any questions, you know, drop me a line, you know, in there, I will, um, link my eBay store. And again, I really appreciate you guys watching and thank you very much. We will see you next time. Bye. Okay, and... <laughs>